Well, Luca, congratulations. Through to the last 16 of the Indian Open, uh, and you've only dropped one frame. How are you feeling? Yeah, very good. My game is in good shape. Uh, my, my scoring ability is up there. Uh, so, yeah, I'm just happy to get through. And, uh, yeah, it's because Andrew is a good player. He's had a good season. He's been playing well, so it was, I thought it was going to be tough today. But I was lucky he missed a few, and I, got, I didn't miss much, really. Yeah, back-to-back -back centuries is always satisfying. It could have been, uh, could have been three centuries in the match. Yeah, exactly. Um, about two years ago, uh, I was playing well, but my breaks weren't really there. So I've worked on that. And you can tell this season I've, I've had one match where I've had three centuries in a row. So yeah, I've been playing really well and hopefully I can keep this up. That seems to be the, the measure of a player now. Players are making lots of centuries. We've, we're seeing maximums flying in. We've seen 1147 this, this week from Zhu Yulong. Um, you know, I was talking to John Higgins and he was saying, you know, you actually have to make multiple maximums in a match or something mm. now to, to stand out. Yeah, you have to score so hard because if you don't do that, you're never going to win a tournament. You, you don't have a chance to win a tournament even. So, yeah, uh, that was something I had to work on and it's paying off, I think. We enjoyed watching you at the shootout. A century, it was a fantastic century from you there. How much did you enjoy that experience? Yeah, I enjoyed it a lot. Uh, I didn't enjoy when Tepchaya made a, a 139 because he took my high break price. <laughs> but uh, yeah, that was that was so much fun. The shootout, I always enjoy it, uh, going there and playing there. Of course, we saw we saw Ben Mertens there, your countryman. Uh, I mean, he, he's he's an exciting young player. Obviously, just kind of raw talent at the moment. He's, he's potting balls, and that's exciting people people are talking about him what, what do you think of Ben yeah Ben is a very good player uh, I practice with him some, sometimes um, so yeah he's uh, he's the biggest talent in Belgium obviously so uh, hopefully he can he can improve uh, and hopefully join me on the main tour one time in the last sort of 10 years I mean you're 10 years on from him I imagine your game has changed massively over that period you, you've you've learned so much you've won a ranking title um, you've made a maximum break uh, you know you, I, I imagine your game's come on leaps and bounds in that period it's a long time for a player yeah exactly even I mean when I won the tournament two years ago in China even if I compare it to now I'm a much better player now I think um, so yeah you obviously go through a lot of phases and in, in snooker and yeah Ben just needs to enjoy it and practice as much as he can and not think just think about snooker and nothing else really. I want to do the best I can uh, for myself and for Belgium. Uh, hopefully I can yeah, maybe get to number one uh, sometime and, or win the World Championship. That would be amazing for Belgian snooker, I think. And it's Scott Donaldson for you in the, in the last 16 here. I guess the one thing you've been missing this season is, is, is a ranking kind of quarter final or a latter stages um, run. So that, that's the aim this week. Yeah, exactly. I've been getting to the last 32 and last 16s nearly every tournament, I think. Uh, but you just need to, to get that quarter or semi-final and even a final. That, that's what you're aiming for. So hopefully this time, but obviously Scott Donaldson is a, he's a very good player. I've, I've always rated him quite highly. I hope you get it. Hopefully.